Here comes the field for tonight's sixth race as they parade to the post behind Kathy McDonald, one I'm Steven. Owned by Charlie Brannigan, driven by Randy Tharpson to Grin Reaper. Owned by driver Dave Rankin and Ellicott Shaker Motors Incorporated. Three, no fear of flying. Owned by Dr. Gary Boudin's Gusty Stable. Driven tonight by Quigley Down Under, Jim Lackey. Four, Louis Bellini, owned by Jerry and Betty Smith and Christine Walters, Ricky McCumber. Number five, Mean Mr. Mustard, owned by Jim Borchers and Bill Walters. Six, King of Crombie, owned by Robert Darrow, James Darrow, and Alan Skolnick, driven by David Hawk. Seven is Western Hero, owned by the Brittany Farm with Jeff Fout. Eight, Gifted Cowboy, owned by Diana Eckley and Norma Huber. Brad Hanners will be in the sulky. Field for the sixth, three-year-old pace, post time in five minutes. Field is now in motion. And there they go. They're off fan pacing. Western here on the far outside and gifted cowboy going with them. I'm Steven will take the pocket in third. They're down the back stretch. Grin Reaper, no fear of flying up on the outside. Louis Bellini. After that comes mean Mr. Mustard and King of Crombie. As they move to the opening quarter mile, Paul and Easley taking over command. It's Western Hero by a length and a half. Gifted Cowboy moves in to be second, followed by I'm Steven third. Rallying by the opening quarter in a solid 27 and three fifths. Racing past the stands to the half mile pole. Western Hero continues to lead Gifted Cowboy second. I'm Steven third, no fear of flying, comes to the outside. Grin Reaper along the rail, Looney, Louis Bellini is up on the outside. King of Crombie on the far outside and mean Mr. Mustard play and catch up. They're at the half mile pole. Western Hero and no fear of flying. They're at the half and 57. They're out of the turn and down the back stretch. Western Hero on top by a length. No fear of flying moves up on the outside. Gifted Cowboy the pocket. I'm Stevens giving the rail in fourth. Louis Bellini's gapping cover. After that, Grin Reaper. King of Crombie and Mean Mr. Mustard can't relish this journey. As they hit three quarters, Western Heroes got the top and won 24 and four. Trying to sting the field now after that backside panel 27 and four. They move to the head of the stretch, but he cannot shake loose from Gifted Cowboy. Little more than an eighth of a mile to drive. Here comes Gifted Cowboy up on the outside, but Western Hero digs down deep. It's Western Hero on top. Right alongside Gifted Cowboy, Gifted Cowboy, Western Hero, Gifted Cowboy. Very, very, very tight. Top down in the sixth time, Steven was seventh, Grin Reaper fourth, no fear of flying third. Louis Bellini was eighth, Mean Mr. Mustard was fifth, King of Crombie sixth, Western Hero the winner, Gifted Cowboy was second. Seven, four, three, eight, five, six, one, two, and the mile was 153 and two.